Ladies and gentlemen, WWE SmackDown from the Performance Center in front of an empty crowd just went off the air. And um, an interesting night of wrestling here um, on uh, Fox. Uh, look, I'm going to start this first things first. You know, this whole coronavirus thing has everyone whacked out. You know, people are worried and stuff. Just follow what people are saying for hygiene and be careful and... You know, I know a lot of people are hating on WWE because they haven't canceled WrestleMania and they didn't cancel their shows, but they're being adjusting. They've moved SmackDown from Detroit to Orlando. They did the same thing with Raw, which was supposed to be in Pittsburgh. Uh, they canceled the two house shows this weekend, one in Toronto, the one in Youngstown, Ohio. And, um, you know, sometimes in moments like these, you need a, an exit. And, you know, with all the sports being suspended, uh, UFC tomorrow, you know, tonight was a good way to have that exit with WWE and SmackDown. And, um, you know, just quickly going to say this, the best part of the show was Triple H. You know, I think it was just obvious that him and Cole were just fucking around since they didn't have Vince in their ear telling, don't do that, damn it, you're supposed to be professional. Mention the titles, mention Roman all the time. You know, instead it was just... No, they just messed around. The Triple H was having a blast, and Cole was having fun too. It felt like a no, like it felt so, you know, easy going. It felt like you know it was fun. It was fun to watch the first part. Everything besides, I will complain that they put the <laughs> the tag chamber into tonight's SmackDown, which you know I get they did for the 2015 Raw that got canceled after the Rumble. So they showed the replay of the WWE title match, which was Rollins, Lesnar, and Cena, and the Rumble match itself. You know, I get why they did it, but like that match wasn't really worth like re-showing again. But I guess they had to. And uh, you know, from the stuff with Bailey, Sasha, Alexa, and Cross, you know that stuff, and then Oscar got involved. You know, and Triple H is just always interacting with commentary and people. Uh, Brian versus Cesaro was okay, and. Um, you know, Roman's interview was cool. Cena's interview with then Bray interrupting was really interesting, was really different. It was, uh, it was interesting to hear what Cena had to say, since Cena basically mentioned that he doesn't bury people, it's just that they, there's this, a generation of superstars that are just lazy. They give up when the going gets too hard, and Bray is part of that generation, and he's going to end Bray Wyatt. And then Bray, who was who and probably ran out, sat in the crowd while he was cutting his promo to then, you know, get in the ring. And there was no fighting; it was just words. And uh, you know, Bray saying that uh, Cena is an addict for the spotlight, and that WrestleMania is going to be a slaughter. Um, mentioning WrestleMania, they did not mention a date for Mania besides the advertisements that they would show. Um, since they can't really just change the advertisement, just say. WrestleMania coming soon. <laughs> so they still leave the April 5th date. But for Roman's segment, for Cena and Bray, um, they did not mention anything about a date for WrestleMania. So I think it's because we're probably going to have an update on that coming next week, uh, probably around Monday or Tuesday. So keep your heads up for that. So, you know, tonight's SmackDown was an interesting show, to say the least. It was really interesting to have that and be in an empty arena, but it just. Sh shows more in what kind of situation we are today this week and um, hopefully in a short amount of time we'll be able to watch shows together and see crowds packing WWE arenas or it'd be AEW arenas and um, hopefully the world comes back to normal. Thank you for watching ladies and gentlemen make sure to leave a like make sure to subscribe to the Raffle Duke Page Guy channel and have yourselves a very good Friday evening.